First, when we start the machine, you can see here the system self-test to protect the machine and provide an emergency situation. And then we can choose for adult use or children use. And under the children using mode, we can also use for neonatal about two kilogram. Then we enter into the main interface. You can see here, we have the four parts for the alarming function, waveform, monitoring parameters, and the setting parameters. So here, also we have the functions like parameter setting, like IPPV, AC, SIMV, PCV, PSV, and spontaneous. And also if you want the APRV or PRVC, we can add on the ventilation mode as well. And then here is the alarming limit setting. Also we have the nebulizer function, and also we have the ETCO2 module, and it can be monitored on the screen directly. So here you can see this is the expiration port. Here is for nebulizer function. And this is the ETCO2 port, and here is the inspiration port. This button is for adjusting the oxygen concentration. For the humidifier we're using, here is with the digital shown. So the temperature will be shown digitally on this screen, very convenient and comfortable. And we can use this button to set the temperature for the patient. And for this air compressor, it's a new compressor. You can connect the central gas supply to our air compressor and then connect the air compressor to our main engine. So actually, the air compressor can automatically testing if there is the gas come out from the central gas supply. If there is no gas, then our air compressor can automatically start so it can prevent any damage to the patient. So this is the main construction of our model.